Whether I'm presenting to a large group or working in the quiet of my own office, the new Windows offers versatile, simple ways to work the way I want to. I can easily control settings, project to an external monitor, or use the new Miracast technology to broadcast to a projector or TV without worrying about cables or network access. Windows has collected the most essential settings for effective mobility into one convenient place, the Mobility Center. To open the Mobility Center from the desktop, I right-click or press and hold the Start button to access the Quick Link menu. Then, I simply tap Mobility Center. Although some settings vary by device, I can control most of the same basic settings from the Mobility Center. For example, using these two slide arrows, I can control my device's brightness and volume settings. To the right is the battery status. When I'm presenting or working on the go, I often have to disconnect from my power source. In these instances, I can monitor my battery life and change the power saving settings. In general, I like to use the balanced setting so that Windows will automatically balance performance and power depending on how I'm using my device. I can also sync my settings to keep duplicate copies of my files in two different locations. Now to my favorite settings, projecting. With the new windows, I can move seamlessly between working at my desk and giving presentations in the conference room using a few simple features without ever leaving my work behind. Let me show you how. When I'm at my desk, I like to connect my tablet device to a larger secondary monitor. To do that, from the Mobility Center, I simply select Connect Display. From here, I can choose to duplicate my main display on the secondary monitor, or I can choose to extend, which gives me two independent screens. I can even choose to show only content on my second screen. When I need to leave my desk to give a presentation or share content with a big group, the new Miracast technology makes things easy. With Miracast, I can project from my Windows 8.1 or Windows 8.1 RT device to a Miracast-enabled big screen in just a few steps. This technology works only with supported Windows 8.1 devices and Miracast-enabled displays. If my TV or projector has no Miracast support, I can easily use a Miracast receiver like the ActionTech ScreenBeam Pro or Netgear Push to TV so that my system can accommodate this technology. Before I begin projecting for the first time, I need to make sure my Windows 8.1 device has the latest Windows updates or optional driver updates. Once I'm in range of the Miracast receiver, I'll need to add it as a device. To do this, I access the charms by swiping in from the right edge and then selecting Devices. Next, I select Project and then choose Add a Wireless Display. Windows automatically scans for any Miracast receivers in range. When the device I want appears, I select it. My big screen will prompt me to enter a code into my device. And now the tablet is wirelessly projecting on the screen. The next time my device is in range, it'll recognize the receiver automatically. Now that my devices are connected, I'm ready to select how I want to project my content. To do this, I open Devices once again from the Charms. Here, I select Project. Because I'm giving a Microsoft PowerPoint presentation, I'll select Extend so that I can use Presenter View in PowerPoint. This is great because I can see my speaker notes, the next slide, and several slide controls while the wireless display shows the audience my full screen presentation, even in full high definition 1080p if the TV or projector supports it. To disconnect my tablet from the projection device, I simply access the project menu again. Here, I select disconnect. Or if I go out of range of the receiver, my device will disconnect automatically. Whether in a conference room down the hall, in my office, or presenting to a large group, the new Windows helps me work efficiently and seamlessly. <laughs>